Hello and welcome to another Bill Bear mailbag video. Um, thank you to the anonymous or anonymous plural people who purchased this kit and this mat um, because they came the same day but in different packages with no notes. So I don't know if one person bought both of these or two people bought them and they just happened to buy them at, like around the same time. I, I don't know. Thank you to whoever made these purchases. I guess we'll just say that. Um, this is the Rising Gundam from G Gundam, and this is a mat here. This is a cutting mat, a self-healing cutting mat, as they say. Uh, there are two sides to the mat. We'll talk about the mat first, and then the mobile suit. Um, these were both purchased off my Amazon wish list. You can find the link in the show description below. If you would like to pick up something off my Amazon wish list here, I'm just going to uh, level that out with there. Uh, as you can see, uh, this is just, I mean, it's just a mat. It is just a, a nice little mat here that you can... Put some cuts in. We'll, we'll put a cut on this side because it's got all of the, you know, whatever. But basically, you can put a cut in there. I can't even really feel where that cut is. Um, it is to protect your work surfaces, especially if you're working on wood. Obviously, this is uh, this white is, uh, you know, I don't a plastic material, um, a heavy plastic. Uh, but yeah, this is just to protect their work surface. Also, uh, in our, our case here, um, I do have the white background or the white table. So this is just something a little different. I don't know if all of these lines are going to be great for the overhead camera, but it seems fine. Um, it, it seems to not be a problem. I'll let, you know, I'll let y'all know. Uh, and, and you'll also, you'll let me know on streams if this is something that you're just like, I hate it. I hate it so much. Uh, but it is nice to have something to uh, a build service to work on when I indeed work on the Rising Gundam, which will be the next thing I work on when the Heavy Arms uh, Eagle unit is finished. Um, this was purchased on my Amazon wish list. As, as it was the mat. Again, don't know who. Thank you. Uh, this is a kit from 1994. It was released. Uh, in 94, you got your non-graded 1 for 4 scales like this. And you also were actually, is it 1 for 4? It's a non-graded kit. Um, I believe it is a 144 scale. It might even be smaller. Uh, we got the nine grade, non grade kits, and then you also got the 1100 high grade kits. I've never seen a 1100 Rising Gundam. I've seen this before. Uh, I've never built it, but I've seen it in stores. I've never seen the 1100 Rising. I don't think they made that many of them. It would be weird if they did because, I mean, so you might say, I've seen some of G Gundam. I don't remember the Rising Gundam. It's only in one episode. Uh, this was the sister Gundam to the Shining Gundam, uh, the main Gundam for G Gundam, uh, meant to be a support and was really just there to fight the Devil Gundam, not for duels. Um, it was piloted by Rain. It was originally meant for, uh, uh, what's his name? The guy with the mask, half mask, uh, uh, the guy that, uh, spoilers, does bad things. Anyway, the, the, the military leader, um, whose name I can't remember, was supposed to pilot this. Rain pilots it. It's similar. Like I said, it's a sister Gundam, so it does have a modified shining finger. Um, the God Gundam, there is no um, uh, version, like to pairs like the Rising, Rising and Shining. There's no uh, God for that. There is the Burning Gundam. No pair for the God, I should say. The Burning Gundam is only in Gundam Breaker Battlelog, and that's like an imagined, what if you upgraded the Rising Gundam? like the Shining Gundam was upgraded to the God Gundam. So that's kind of what the Burning Gundam is. And that's why it has like, uh, that's just an imagination thing. Um, but the Rising Gundam, again, only piloted by Rain in one episode, heavily damaged, and is in some video games, but like is definitely not super well known. Uh, this is just a kit that I've never built. I've never built this version. Um, we can look at that real quick. As again, 1994, you've got some instructions with color in here, which is nice. Um, uh, and uh, apparently bare bones uh, build. Um, there are stickers. I have them aside. Uh, they're not in the box. Let me grab those just so you can look at those. Um, oh, come on, come on. There we go. There they are. Uh, so plenty of stickers for this kit, which makes sense. There will be color correcting stickers because come on you know we're not we're this is very bare bones very light uh um but yeah plenty of polycaps including the hands being polycapped um and we can towards that a little bit yeah um small little kit this is gonna be tiny teeny tiny again i don't believe this is 144 this is just a non-grade kit not a high grade uh that was the 1 100 scale high grade it was again i've never seen 
Uh, good looking kit, uh, fun design. I'm excited to work on it, uh, as you can see there. Uh, it does have the shield. It does also have like a, a pincer weapon. Um, the shield is, is odd looking in a way that I like. It does have the capsule pilot like, that it drives in from the back um, that will build the backpack is actually a vehicle, which is fun. And yeah, this is a cool looking kit that I am excited to uh, put together. So thank you to the anonymous person that purchased this uh, and the anonymous person or the same anonymous person that purchased the um, uh, this here. I went too far. I went too far. Uh, the pitch, this mat, I will be using this mat. We, I will see from you, the audience, if you like this or not. But I think it's going to be a fine addition to our build uh, building area and uh, the streams. So thank you to the person who bought this. You can find the links to my Amazon wish list, my throne wish list, and a way at how to go and buy a gift card at USA Gundam Store. Um, if you would like to support the streams, you're watching this video also supports it. So thank you very much for that. And I'll see you on the next one. Goodbye.